Yeah, talk to him. Yeah, Brown. I need you to meet me at Let That Earn Loop 12. Should I call for backup? No. No backup. It's a personal matter. So, are you okay? Yeah, yeah, just, just get over here. Hurry up. Hey, we gotta go. What's up, man? I saw it to the trouble. Brown, what's going on? Sarge is at a jam on Let Better Loot 12. What's he doing in the hood? Working on the cover. Do we need a call for backup? No, no. He said no backup. Let's go. Hey, Miss Carter. It's Nicole. I got some good news for you. Meet me first thing in the morning at the agency. to you. Some broad lured me in here and she robbed me. A, a woman? Did you see what she was wearing? Mm. Hold on, no, 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 no report. Understand, this stays between us. Okay? Sarge, there's a woman running around Look, there with a- Look, I said no report. Now you two get your asses out there and find her and keep your mouth shut. Yes, sir. You are in your drawers and you got a rope on her. I said go find her. Go. Let's go. Nicole? Just have a seat. She'll be with you in a minute. Okay, thank you. Okay. Got it. You lost your job. Yes, ma'am, I did about, about two months ago. So you don't have any income right now? No, I don't. Not right now. No. The uh, unemployment office is around the corner, and McDonald's is always hiring. McDonald's, with all due respect, I'm already struggling with this child support thing. I ain't flipping no damn burgers. That ain't even me. Well, you got two choices. You can flip burgers, or you can take a six-month vacation down to the county. <laughs> it kind of give you a little time to think about some things. Pick one. Where y'all say the unemployment office at again? Right, right down the there. To your right. Thought so. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Mr. Rowe. Hey. Hey. Got any sugar? Yeah, there should be some over there. What are you doing up here? Is that all you have to say? What are you talking about? Have you tracked down Mr. Carter? I found him. Hey, what are we doing up here? Trying to work. Oh. oh, hey, I didn't know you were up here. Listen, Mrs. Carter's downstairs. She wants to talk to you. Oh, tell her I'll be right there. OK. She doesn't have to worry about him being late anymore. How can you be so sure? Nicole. Nicole. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Hello, Miss Carter. I got your message. Fantastic. Come with me. Helping Hands Agency, this is Stacy speaking. Good morning, if you'll let me take care of this. One second. Thank you. Okay. This is for you. I can't believe you got him to pay something. 
I was having difficulty even serving him papers. You know how the police all stick together. Yeah, well, you won't have to worry about that too much anymore. Just stop by the office on the 5th of each month to collect payment. I just wonder what made him pay. Damn, baby, you look good. Can I go freshen up? Just, just don't make me wait too long. See what's inside my panties. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, you see, I'm a naughty girl. Mm. And I like to do things naughty. So, what I want you to do is put your hands behind your back. you to do? Uh -huh. I want you to take my panties off with your teeth. <laughs> what the hell's wrong with you? Shut the hell up. My ex-wife put you up to this? Shut up. If she did, that bitch won't see a dime of my money. I tell you to shut up. Great. Aggravated robbery? Lady, you're gonna do 20 Sergeant years Sergeant Carter. Well, if it ain't the damn police. Lady, you know a I A dirty make... cop and a deadbeat ass dad. All this cash, and you don't pay a damn dime of child support. You're not gonna get away with this. Oh, won't I? <laughs> Look here. That won't look good, too good on the Dallas Morning News now, would it? So what I want you to do is, I want you to give me a real big smile. How about that? Hmm? Say cheese. <laughs> I mean, he kept on skipping court dates and telling my lawyer that it was interfering with his duties. And then he had the nerve to even say that we had already made arrangements. Trust me, he and I have made arrangements. Thank you. So, so much. I, I, I don't even know how to repay you. Just your 10% will do. Thank you so much for your help. You have a wonderful day. Oh, yeah. Send over these things for the baby. Cedric, you didn't have to do that. Your son has everything that he needs. Yeah, yeah, I know, but 
How big is he now? <laughs> He's getting very big. He eats and sleeps all day. Can I see him? Look, Cedric, I I don't know if that's a good idea. I just want to hold him. Cedric, Please? Cedric, you know that if she caught you here, she would have you arrested. I still have a right to see my son, don't I? Yeah. Yeah, you do. Yeah. Let me see. Just wait right here, OK? OK. Miles, come on in. I thought I'd stop by and drop these off. It's mine? <laughs> yes. It's yours. You've been awarded 100 acres. 100 acres. And then when the mayor wins her second term, she's gonna sign the funding bill for my restoration project. And you, my friend, are gonna be a very rich man. Can you imagine? Miles Duncans, a rich man. Oh, I owe you, my friend. Oh, you big. <laughs> oh, and one more thing? Yeah. My accountant will be in touch. You have a good day. A good day indeed. Look who's here. So little. Can you hold him? Oh, come on, come on. The fairy so... looks more like you every day. Oh. <sighs> so cute. You know, my mom would love to see him. Do you think you can bring him over by my mama's house? Cedric, you know. I mean, you know that that would mean everything to me, but with my mom. Okay, um, I mean, thank you for giving me a beautiful son. All right, bye, girl. Bye, sir. We have a problem. Hey, Joey, what's up? Hey, doll. I'm kinda waiting for this phone call. How you been? Oh, hey, look, I need your help. Sure. Yeah, I'm trying to track down this guy. Having a little trouble with it, and that's where I need your help. Yeah, just, just send me as much pedigree as you can, and I'll get my guys to work on it. Cool, so what I'm gonna do is text his info to you yeah. and get back to you. Okay. All right. Peaches. Peace. Love you, bye. Oh, this one for the radio. This for my girls that got some smoke with baby daddy. They don't take care of their kids. When you see them in the club, just tell them like this. Oh, my baby daddy. You need to give this music shit up and get a real damn job. What's going on? Yo, ain't nothing but my baby mom's tripping. I know you ain't in here taking care of somebody else, baby. You can't even take care of your own. That's not my baby. What? Oh, don't play. Don't even play. Since you over here playing daddy daycare, take your own. What's up, Shorty? Right? What the hell? Where's she going? Yo! What's going on? Yo, Alicia! Yo, what you come up in here with this shit for, man? I told you. 
When I get paid, you get paid. So what am I supposed to do in the meantime? Junior needs some milk and some pampers. <sighs> Borrow the money from your moms, and I'll pay it back when I get the advancement from my record deal. Your record deal? Yeah. My mama? Your moms. I got y'all. Bugging, man. You know what? what? That's okay. I got something for your deadbeat ass. Oh, it's like that now, right? What you come to the door for, man? You know how she be acting, man. No, I don't know how she be acting. What was all that? Man, you know, we need to talk. You know, I'm gonna strap up. Ooh, that's a lesson, huh? Look, dude, that ain't the boy. Hey, hey. Hey, what's up? Thanks for meeting me at such a short notice. No sweat. I got you a time, a place, and a room key. A room key? Yep. I'm impressed. Hey, can you do me a favor? Mm -hmm. On the front seat of the car, there's an envelope. Can you bring it back for me? Yeah. Okay, nice. Yeah, so how's Jasmine and Asia? Oh, they're great. And the twins? Spiced you as ever. Tell me this. Of all of the places we could have met way here. Well, um, I think there's a Geo Metro on level seven that you might be interested in. Go check it out. Okay. That was on the house. You're awesome. You are great. I know. Thank you. <laughs> All right, good luck. Be careful. Thanks. All right, See bye. you. You stay right where you are. Please don't shoot. Don't give me a reason to. Are you Lee Gwen? Yes. Do you have a son named Jojo Gwen? The boy is not my son. That's what they all say. Look, I even take a DNA test to prove it's not my son. She's lying. The kid's yours, I'm coming back after you. <sighs> Looks like you had a rough morning. Rough ain't even the half of it. You know that Gwen case I've been working on? When I approached him for payment, he said the kid wasn't his. It's not. No. He's even willing to take a DNA test to prove it. Do you think he's telling the truth? I don't know what to think anymore. This is like it's become a circus. I'm so tired of it. I know what you mean, but what else can we do? Been thinking about that. <sighs> Has your son's father ever paid child support? No. Does he have a job? He's a rapper. <laughs> a rapper. Are you serious? Yeah. So, what does he expect you to do in the meantime? Clearly, he doesn't care. <sighs> Look, since he has no legal place of employment, the only other alternative you have is putting him in jail. And what good is that gonna do? I don't wanna get him thrown in jail. I know. We will get the paperwork started, and we'll send it over to the Attorney General's office so he can be served. I'm taking the steps. Mm. Listen, ladies, our hands are tied. 
We have 30 new cases this week alone. And we've only been able to locate five people to collect child support payments. Well, I just had to deal with two of our clients' parents' attorneys because mm -hmm. the parents don't want to change the child support arrangements because they are receiving welfare benefits. Mm -hmm. Look, I don't know what else we can do. I know what we can do. We need to kick some asses around here and then maybe we can see some results. Okay, for real. Give, Give them, them a little bit of their own medicine. We, we down. Uh-uh. <laughs> That's not legal. <laughs> legal? What's legal about not taking care of your kid? Okay, but mm. we cannot break the law now. Fuck the law. Uh-uh, I can't do that. Miles is an attorney. Fuck him, too. Ooh. You are out of line. Ladies, calm down. <sighs> it's like you're trying to jeopardize everything we've built. No, I'm trying to do my job. Okay, so you think running around Dallas, whooping men's asses is the answer to our problem? Shh, it's the start. No, it's barely scratching the surface, and it's not gonna solve our problem. The only way to solve a problem is to get to the root of it. It's sad to say, but the root of our problem is the system itself. How many women come in here and are practically forced to put their men on child support? <laughs> then he end up fifteen or twenty thousand dollars behind. Now he locked up. Sometimes I feel like we destroy more families than we help. <sighs> Look, I don't mind whooping some ass, but that's not the business we're in. So, you really want to kick some ass? Why don't you try focusing your energy? on the one who spent the web, and not the prey that's caught up in it. Yes. Ladies, this is important, I have to take this. Whatever. Dang, you so mean. You guys, something to drink? Um, you have sweet tea? Mm -hmm. All right, let me have one of those. All the same. All right. So, how are things down at the office for you? Yes. Baby, you guys ready to order? Um, just give us a second here. Yeah. What would you say? <laughs> this business is getting on my damn nerves. <laughs> I told you. I mean, I'm saying, I told you, there was gonna be hell trying to catch some of those fools. It's like they know we're coming every time. Mm -hmm. Are y'all ready? Um, I have the usual uh, chicken and salad. Me too. So, how are things at the mayor's office? Oh, uh, things are good, things are good. I got a couple of things in the, in the works, and then once this election is over, uh, then we can go ahead and start planning on settling down. Excuse me? Settling what? <laughs> um. Baby. No, Miles, you know I'm not ready for that. Why else you think I'm putting all this time and effort in this relationship? When, when were you gonna tell me? Baby, I just did. I mean, I want to, I, I got plans. Baby, I have this baby, business baby, to run, baby, and baby. I don't have time for kids and babies right now, Miles. Look, that's okay, what I'm but, telling you now. Anyway, how is the mayor? <clears throat> you okay? Yeah. Drink slowly, baby. Yo, what up? Did I catch you at a bad time? Who's this? I met you at the club a couple of days ago, after your performance. Girl, you know how many girls I met at the club that night? 
I had on the short red dress. Girl with the red dress. Mm. Oh yeah, now I remember. What's going on? I was hoping I could spend some time with you. Well, I'll tell you what, that could happen. I live down here in the Loft District. I'm gonna text you my info. Why don't you come on through? What's up, Miles? Detective. I need you to quickly fumigate our little pest problem. What are you talking about? I got problems of my own. Do you realize how important this election is for the mayor and how this little baby situation can ruin her chances of re-election? Do you realize how much I have invested in this situation? What are you trying to say? What am I trying to say? Yeah. Hmm. Detective, it would be a shame if a leak got out about the missing money from that Richard go. Dominguez drug lord bust from last week. Mm-hmm. You were the leading detective on that case, right? Hmm. Handle our situation. Yeah. By the way, Miles, how's Jasmine? <laughs> Son of a bitch. Hey, love, come on in. Thank you. Seems like you found the place, all right? Yeah, yeah. Cool. You know, sometimes people say I give bad directions, you know? <laughs> it's quite all right. Did you see something you like? Oh, yeah, Ab absolutely. Oh, what a handsome little boy. Yeah, it's my little shorty. I bet you take real good care of him, don't you? Yeah, something like that. <laughs> Can I get you something to drink? <laughs> thirsty? Oh. oh, yeah, um, water, please. All right, cool. Grab that. Can't believe this nigga got all this fly ass shit and ain't paying child support. Ice cold. Oh, thank you. Oh, you're so welcome. Where's your bathroom? Um, it's uh, right over there. Thank you. All right, cool. It's all clean and stuff, so you don't gotta worry about nothing. <laughs> oh, snap. Damn, baby, I see all that at the club. You know, you have a beautiful place. It pays to be a rapper. A little something like that. Why don't you come over here? Let me see what's under that trench coat. Oh, fine, right there. Just come here a little bit. It's the goody good right there. Ah! Damn, you like it rough? Oh, well, I wouldn't want you to hurt yourself. Actually, might not be a bad thing. Yo, what the, what the hell is going on here? Nah, <laughs> what you mean, what the hell is going on here? I want something from you. What the hell do you want? Money. So you jacking a nigga? Oh, well, you catch on pretty fast, don't you? Is this a joke? Does that look like a joke? Damn, baby, I'm just saying, though. Yeah, what you just saying? I'm just saying, though. Ugh. If you say I'm just saying one more time, I'm gonna blow your head off. Now, I want money and your $20,000 in the rear. So for now, I'll just take half. Empty your wallet. Give me your wallet. 10000 Give me your wallet. $10,000? Give me your I wallet. I don't have $10,000. wallet. I don't have $10,000 in my wallet. Yeah, well, I'll get whatever you got in your wallet. I'll take whatever I can get. You better stay right there. You better not. It's like that? Yeah. It's like that. Yeah, this is crazy for real. Yeah. Right. <clears throat> hmm. Okay, look here. 
you're still about $15,000 in the rear. So here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna pay $1,000 every month, and $1,000 you're gonna pay every month until you're caught up. <laughs> but you out your damn mind. Uh-uh. But you know what I want you to do? I want you to smile for the camera. Tell you, bitchy, say it, say it, say And if you say one word about this, I'm gonna blast your ass on Excuse me, Cedric? Yeah. Are you Cedric? Yeah, that's me. Listen, I hear you've been harassing the mayor and her daughter. No. I have a son. Listen, take this as a warning, OK? All right, so what you're saying is that somebody broke in, held you at gunpoint, and then beat you down. Yeah, officer, that's exactly what I'm saying. Mr. Jenkins, this scene does not look like a forced entry. What, you think I'm lying? So, um, <clears throat> did you get a good look at the suspects? Dude, for the last time, it was like four guys with ski masks. I didn't get a good look at none of them. Yo, Hollis, <laughs> I'm taking a look at this. Yo, oh, Tyrone. Yeah? What kind of gun did you say to use again? It was like a sort of AK-47. OK. Man, he pulled it out almost peed yeah. a little bit. <laughs> yeah, it made me pee too, man. Hey, if anything else comes up, man, just give us a call, all right? I will do. <laughs> I appreciate y'all concern. Let's go, man. All right, Tyrone, just take a few deep breaths, splash some water on your face, and simmer down. Just give us a holler if you hear anything. Gee, thanks. Mayor Polinsky, the polls seem to be in your favor. Do you think this is due to your support of the Child Support Cleanup Project? Yes, I feel the city knows how important children in education are to me and my administration. Well, the citizens have an opportunity to ask you questions. We are working with the Attorney General and some private sectors trying to restore funds to single parents, as well as the parents who are paying child support so we can legally have their rights honored. And they can spend time with their children. This is why I believe this DNA project is vital to our project as well. Mayor Polinsky, you mentioned DNA test testing. As parents know who are seeking testing is very expensive, so how will people in low-income areas be able to afford it? I will challenge every clinic one day a week to open up its doors for free DNA testing. This will be beneficial to single parent families and also aid and assist to help us to get the child support collected. Mayor, what role are you playing in playing the DISD yeah, school uh, district issues? No questions from now. Uh, the mayor has a very tight schedule to keep. Madison, I'll be at the park today around 4 o'clock. I want to see my son. I can't promise you anything. Today, Madison. Mm -hmm. I can't believe it. That's crazy. Hey, what's going on in here? Hey, hey girl. Hey. Did you hear what happened to Tyrone Jenkins? Uh, no. He was beaten and robbed last night at his place. Girl, they whooped his ass. Mm -hmm. Uh, Tyrone. Oh. Oh, that Tyrone, yeah. The polls look good. The city loves you. 
and I smell a victory. For now, anyway. I told you not to worry. It's taken care of. Do you know what my white conservative friends are gonna do when they find out that I have a grandbaby? You know I don't have anything against blacks. I just don't understand how she got herself pregnant by... What was she thinking? That's just it, sweetheart. She wasn't thinking. How could I have been so stupid? Oh, come now. You're not being stupid. You're simply looking out for the future of your family in this city. If anything happens, the bar is coming after you. <laughs> oh, I'm not planning on this not working. So just relax. Everything will be fine. Everybody's already gone for the day, for lunch. Are you going to get something? No. You're not going to lunch? No. Nicole, is there something you want to tell me? Like what? Don't make this about your stepfather. Don't ever mention his name to me again. Look, I understand how you feel, but we have to play by the rules. Rules? What rules protected me from getting molested by my stepfather, Jasmine? I know. No. shelters and, and sleeping in cars, being hungry, and hand-me-down clothes. That's the reason why we started this agency. But if we don't do things the right way, we won't be able to help anyone. We've been doing this three, four years the right way. And it still takes forever to get things done. Conversation, and you're worried about a date with Miles. He's a good man. Nicole. I didn't say he wasn't a good man. I'm sure he is one of the good guys. I mean, he works hard, believes in God, doesn't stray the whole night in shining armor. Bit. I'll talk to you later.
Yeah, this Tyrone Jenkins case doesn't make sense. Yeah, well, we know that he definitely did get jacked by somebody with a sawed-off AK. <laughs> sawed-off AK-47. You hear that, fool? <laughs> Man, that's the best one I've heard so far. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, talk to me. Okay. Hey, man, good work, man. All right, thanks. Tyrone Bernard Jenkins has a warrant out for his arrest. Really, what for? Failure to pay child support. Receptionist. Can I help you? I noticed the help wanted sign outside. Yes, the mayor's having a DNA drive, so we are gonna need a bunch of help around here. Cool. Okay, so are you used to being around a child support environment? No. But I worked with the Save and Rescue Unit while serving in Iraq. Okay. All right, okay. Nicole, can you come here for a second? She gonna help you out when she can. Cool. So, this young lady is looking for a job and she just got back from Iraq. Oh, part of that Bush bullshit. Glad to be home. Got tired of seeing my people killed. Hmm. Okay. Okay, well, come on back to my desk. Okay. Y'all in or what? <laughs> Jasmine is gonna kick our ass. She'll be all right. But we're not going to kill anybody. OK? I said, OK. <laughs> oh, look at her now. I'm so glad you calmed down, because you were really starting to scare me. <laughs> Did you hear that, soldier? We are not going to kill any civilians. Yes, ma'am. Oh, she's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> I'll hold that for you. Thank you. Thank you, darling. What's the status? Well, Mr. Santiago says his check is in the mail. In the mail? Jace, Jace, it's in the mail. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. How much you seen? <laughs> How much? <laughs> How much? You guys mind? 
she asked you a simple question. How much have you supposedly sent? Half, half. Appreciate you. Half? Now what are your children supposed to do with half? Well, you know what, since he made an effort to pay half, how about I just blow off half? <laughs> No, no, it was on the head. <laughs> huh. Yeah, you've been doing that for a long time now. You've been sending partial payments in the mail for the last six months. Mm. That's because of the stupid economy oh, and the stupid okay. attorney general. Take my passport over the stupid child support store and now I can't even travel to make money. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Stupid! Hello? Hello? Oh, I'm sorry. How can I help you? Um, I heard your commercial on the radio about the free DNA testing. Okay, and what's your name? Cedric Evans. Okay, are you currently paying child support? No. Okay. Fill out the papers in the folder and we'll be with you in just one moment. All right, thank you. Mm -hmm. Hi, I was checking to see if my test results are in yet. And your name? Shelly Dominguez. Shelly Dominguez. Hold on just a second. Thank you. So how many women you say robbed you again? Three, senor. The one lady was asking me about my child support payment. Child support? Si. I told her it was in the mail. The next thing I remember, the door was busting open and two other puntas barred in and attacked me. <laughs> Wasn't quite the fantasy you were looking for, was it? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Brown, take a look at this. Yeah. What we have here? Yeah, yeah, that's definitely a woman's scarf, all right? Huh. So, now there are three deranged women running loose, robbing men yeah. <laughs> of child support checks. You thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah. I think it's time to give Sarge a call. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> hey, hey. We'll be back, okay? See. Si. Don't go nowhere. Brendan? Si. All right. And put on some clothes, man. Let's get a bag for this, all right? Yeah. Hey. Hey. You okay? Yeah. Promise. Yeah. I saw the free DNA testing sign outside the window. And the place should be flooded today. Hmm. Did you know that over $106 billion is owed in child support? You know, Jasmine, just imagine how that money could be used for the children who need shelter and their medical expenses. I know. And food. I know. Not to mention food and clothing. Mm. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> yes? Yes, I have a young man out here who's trying to put himself on child support. Send him in. Probably looking for his daddy. Or he probably is the daddy. Mm. I guess we'll find out. We shall. Mm. Oh, have a seat. This is my partner, Nicole. She helps me run the agency. Are you looking for your father? No, ma'am. I want rights to see my son. Are you paying child support? No. I mean, I want to, but she won't take anything from me. She who? His grandmother. Did you do anything to the kid to make her act like that? No. She just doesn't like me because I'm black. Oh. Okay. So it's okay for you to sleep with her daughter, but it's not okay for you to have a kid by Nicole. Her. Sorry. Sorry. Before we get started, do you have a job? Yes. I bust tables at Freddy's Chicken Shack at night, and during the daytime, I'm a full-time student. Okay. Um, how much are you bringing home? 150 every week. Okay, that's $600 a month and 120 every month in child support. Can you handle that? 
Yes, ma'am. Oh, oh, hold on now. Okay. Let's see, um, did you sign the birth certificate? Hmm. Well, first we're gonna need to get DNA tests to prove that he's your son. He's my son. Madison would never cheat on me. I know what to do. Okay, swab the back of your mouth with this. And when you're done, just put it back in the plastic. Um, is this the correct address where your son's mother lives? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Just give us a few days and we'll get back with you. All right. Thank you, ladies. Thank no you. How are we gonna get DNA from the baby to get tested? Oh, I'll take care of that. This address belongs to Mayor Polinsky. You two guys found that broad yet? Not yet, but we are getting closer. What have you been doing? What have you been doing? Look, we got a phone call about a victim who was beating and robbed last night. Yeah. Not exactly his idea of a fantasy, huh? <laughs> That's great. That's all you've got? Listen, I want her found now. You understand? Or both of you guys will be pushing tickets at the zoo. Do I make myself clear? And look, we got a couple of these we still want. Now! You understand? Yes, sir. All right, got a job for you. Think you can handle it? What you got? Oh, some would-be rapper. But look here, I'm gonna send you to this address. What about the twins? They're not ready yet. And Asia? Mm. You know, I just feel like with your experience, you can handle this better. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, so I want you to be at this address. Do not be late. So you trying to jack a brother? Call it whatever you want. But you're about $19,000 behind in child support. Child support? Child support. All this about some motherfucking child support? Mm-hmm. Man, dig these blues, man. For the last five years I've been going through this shit. And real talk, the kid ain't even mine. Real talk, DNA results right there. Check them out. I got them from the Helping Hands Clinic today. Don't move. Hey, we can do this all day. We can do it all day. The proof in the pudding right there. to make a phone call. You do.
Okay. Okay. You're right. I apologize, brother. No problem. No, see, I apologize because the statute of limitations is already passed. What? Four years. The state of Texas gives you four years to determine you're the father by DNA. So what you telling me is, even though I ain't the father, I still gotta pay? That's what you saying? That's some bullshit. It's the system. Are we cool? My bad. Right back, okay? Okay. Yes. Hi, I'm Oshila, and I'm your cleaning lady today. Where's Miss Rodriguez? She called in sick. But I, that's what I'm trying to tell you. It's, it's just never gonna get better. All she cares about is this election. She, I mean, she's never gonna change. Everything's gonna stay the same. She's got no respect for me. I swear she doesn't care about me. <laughs> I mean, what else can I do, honestly? So let's see, that's one, two, three, four men that have been attacked by three women. Yeah, and a suspect in Sarge's case took $500. Hmm. And he wrote a check to her. I wonder who he wrote that check to. Sweet Chocolate Incorporated. <laughs> Sweet Chocolate. <laughs> Man, Sarge is always a freak, you know that. Oh, you know how he loves his dark chocolate. <laughs> the darker the better. Oh man, that chocolate thunder. <laughs> yeah, what up? Oh, cool. Oh, hey, man. what's up? Alright, cool. Okay, okay, get back with me on the rest of it, okay? Alright. Hey, the hair samples on that scarf belong to Asia Sterling. Alright. Let's go pay Miss Asia a little visit, huh? Oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> and they're gonna be getting back with me with the address, okay? Alright. Let's get out of here. I haven't received a check in mail. Hold on, Robert, baby. Your name, please? Yoko Lee. Hmm. 
says here that the DNA test came back negative. What DNA test? Your computer is wrong. What did you say? Your computer is wrong. Did you say wrong? Yes, wrong. The man that you claim to be your child's father came in and took a DNA test, and he is not the biological father. He's not my baby daddy. In the words of Miss Sophia from The Color Purple, hell no. So just do like Aaliyah, dust yourself off, and try again. Your computer is wrong. Whatever. Next. Hi, Aaliyah. Hey. Hi. I need to talk to you about something. What's going on? I saw Miles' car over the mayor's house this morning. Well, he has to stay on top of her campaign. Like I said, this morning. And like I said, he has to stay on top of the campaign. Yeah, I bet you he was on top of something, all right. You know what, Nicole? What? You really, really trying. Whatever. You got something you want to get off your chest? Jasmine, this is not about me, baby. This is about you walking around with your head in the damn clouds. My head in the clouds. Or yours stuck in the past. No matter how angry you want to be at the world or every single man in your life, none of that emotional shit is going to change what happened to you as a child. So now you want to go there, huh? You're not a child anymore, Nicole. And none of that stuff was your fault, but you're a grown-ass woman now. And if you want to keep living in the past and making the present miserable, that's on you. Yeah, you know what? I do have a few things I want to get off my chest. Oh, well, shit, you ain't said nothing but a word. Looking for uh, Ms. Asia Sterling? Yes, how can I help you? Are you Asia Sterling? Yes, how can I help you? Do you know uh, Mr. Luis Santiago? Who are you guys? Now answer the questions. Do you know anything about him being beaten and, and robbed a couple days ago? I don't know anything about that. Well, explain to us why we found a scarf with your DNA on it in Mr. Santiago's room. Ma'am, you'd make this a whole lot easier and do yourself a whole lot of good if you answered some questions right now. Well, you guys would do yourselves a whole lot of good if you got the fuck away from my door. And she about to piss me off.
You see us over here. Uh-uh, uh-uh. You and you, you need to go to the back of the line. <laughs> my name is Detective Hollis, and this is my partner, Detective Brown. And we need to speak to your director. Do you have an appointment? She is a very busy lady. No, we don't. But it's very important that we speak to her now. Pretty please. Can I help you, gentlemen? Fake 21 Jump Street needs to talk to you. Mm. Okay. Fine, can I see your badges, please? Well, you guys don't mind? Follow me to my office. I mind if we do. <clears throat> If my baby dad is in the circus, can you have him served? <clears throat> you can have a seat. No, that's okay, we'll stand. So, what's this about? Ma'am, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. What brings you here? Ma'am. Does your organization uh, assist parents in collecting child support? Yes. We offer that and many other services for men and women to help get them back on their feet. Have you collected some money from Mr. Jenkins or Mr. Santiago? I'm sorry. That's confidential information. <laughs> Not when there's a crime involved. <laughs> exactly. What are you implying? I believe your agency is doing a little bit more than just collecting money for your clients. Look, we run a legal, law-abiding agency here. If there are any crimes being committed, it's against innocent children being neglected by their deadbeat parents. Gentlemen, if you wouldn't mind, I believe this meeting's over. <laughs> really? Let's go. Okay, I'm positive. Y'all have a good day. Girl, I'm so stressed out. I mean, I don't know what to do. They just showed up at my house and start asking me questions. Hey. I'm like, what the hell happened to you? Nothing. It wasn't my so-called ex-husband, was it? <laughs> Don't be funny. Okay, so what is it you needed to talk to me about so fast? Two detectives showed up at my door asking me questions about Mr. Santiago. Well, what did you tell him? I didn't tell him anything. So what makes them think you're involved? <clears throat> Am I interrupting something? What happened to you? No. Come on in. Two detectives came by today, questioning the integrity of our establishment. I don't know what's going on, but y'all better cut it out. Or I'm gonna shut down the agency. You can't do that. Watch me. Hi, Mayor Polinsky? Yes, sir. That's Thank for you. you so much. Thank you. just came proving that Cedric is the father of your child. I, I don't understand. Understand this. You are destroying my career. Your career? <laughs> Mom, I love Cedric and this is his child. You're ruining my life! Love? You are 17 years old. You know nothing about love. Nothing. I know I don't love being a prisoner in my own house. 
I don't love not being able to take my child out. <laughs> and you know what? I don't love this kind of life. Well, nobody told you to go sleep with a black man. <laughs> so it's just okay for you? Look at me. If I ever catch you with that boy again, I will make sure you never see him or that baby again. <laughs> you got that! Meet me in 15 minutes. She is your child! I'm Nisi. doing everything I you can! You are not doing anything! I send you everything I oh, can. Oh, you didn't even show up to court. Look, you, you, you sent this woman out of my room. This crazy woman out of my room. What else was I room. supposed to do? What do you stop want me it. to do? You're hurting me. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Hey, hey, boss man, um, do you mind if I take off early today? What's wrong, Seth? You never try to be early. Yeah, I'm going to see my son. Uh, cool. Yeah, you got that, man. All right, thank you, man. Thank you. How did this happen? If this gets leaked out to the press, my chances of re-election is history. So is my restoration project. My family's on the line, and all you care about is your goddamn restoration project? Just give me a minute. Hey, you remember that kid Cedric Jones? Handle it. speaking. Okay, um, let me take a message. I am Mr. Malone. Okay, go ahead. Okay, building project approved. I got it. No, thank you. Hey, kid, come here. I need to talk to you. Hey, look, what's going on? Nothing, nothing. That's all right. I'm going home, man. I'll catch up with you later, all right? Nothing, man. Nothing. What, what's going on? Is he, nothing. Is he, is he it's okay. No problem? I'm sorry. Oh, no. Who was that? No, it's nobody. Don't worry about it. It's okay. All right? It doesn't matter. What's up? I mean, you out here fighting. What's going on? Nothing, nothing. What's up? Did you get the evidence from Mark? No, I haven't gotten anything. What? Look, guys, we, uh, found another suspect in those robberies. Uh-huh. Who is she? 
Her name is Asia Sterling. She mm -hmm. works over at the Child Support Agency. Okay. You sure you are? Right? Yes, I'm fine. I'm fine. Sarge, you been paying your child support? That's none of your damn business. Thanks. Long day at the office. I'm like that I was getting better now. Hmm. <laughs> what happened? You ever had one of them days where everything that could possibly go wrong goes wrong? That was today. Every damn thing that could have went wrong went wrong. Oh, okay. Well, um... Mr. Malone called. Yeah. What do you want? Mm, some project you're working on? He said it's approved. Oh, hi, Mr. Kalinsky. Is Madison around? I want to see my son in Madison. Look, I know I'm, I'm not the ideal guy, but can I just see Madison and my son, please? What's wrong? Ms. Polinsky? I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Thought you were gonna get away with this? Get off of me! <coughs> Who did this to you? It was Darlene's husband. Sergeant Carter. I got something for his dirty ass. No. Let's call the police. What are they gonna do? He's one of them. I didn't mean to make you upset, ma'am. Just thought you should know. Are you sure that it's him? Madison didn't really like him that much. She felt like he was just using her mom. I am calling this press conference today to announce that I am dropping out of the race for the mayor of this fine city. Mayor, can you tell us why you're dropping out now when the polls are in your favor? This campaign has cost me the most precious thing in my life, and I need time to heal and be a grandmother to my grandson. So what does the future hold for you? At this moment, I am very uncertain about my future in politics. Tom, you heard that directly from Mayor Polinsky. She is now officially out of this race.
guess you are, huh? So when were you gonna tell me? You've been sleeping with her? Baby, I didn't love her. Baby, I love you. Oh, I love you. Everything I Shut did, up, I, Miles. I did it for you. you I did it for me? us. I did it for our future. Nah, nah, you don't love anybody oh, but yourself. Come on, baby, don't say that. I know Miss Hirsch. You got a real fucked up way of showing it. You know what? Stay the hell out of Jazz, my life. Jazz, Jazz, Jasmine. Baby. 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 Hold up. Hold up. Fuck Miles. Baby. Hold up. Hold up. Let go of my goddamn arm. Jasmine. Baby. Please. Jasmine. <sighs> yeah. And wait till you get around the corner before you blow your fucking brains out. Like what you see? Hell yeah, I like what I see. No. Damn, I've been paying my child support. Oh, I know that. But see, now I heard you've been beating up on women. Mm -hmm. And we just can't have that. Oh, no.
good. She'll wheel up, girl. High than a helicopter, somewhere in the atmosphere. Shining like a bright star, beaming down on my car. Wanna ride with me, wanna hate on me. But I'm chill, real, still drip with the drape on me. Ballin' is a habit, believe it, I keep a stack on me. Got them all six. the last time you paid child support. It's none of your damn it. It's none of your damn it. It's none of your damn it. Whoa. Oh, oh yeah. Are you okay? Are you uh -huh. okay? Don't say that. Are you okay? Yeah. Oh, my God. You can have, like, room. Yeah. Yeah. You can be farther back. <laughs> okay.